The government says there are only risks and no benefits for a common painkiller used for teething toddlers. Dr. Mark Siegel is with us now. First of all, as I understand it, they've told them, get Origel and others like it, get it off the shelves. What's the problem? And this is a big warning, and they've, they've already looked at this before, 2006, 2014. They're saying, get this off the shelves. There's been 119 cases of kids getting sick. What's the problem, Stuart, you ask? The problem is a chemical called benzocaine that's in baby Origel and other products that you put on your gums yep. to get rid of pain. And they have adult versions, too. That stuff can actually interfere with oxygen binding in the blood okay. and lead to rapid heart rate and shortness of breath and could kill you, actually. Four kids have died. So, and by the way, the American Academy of Pediatrics says something else. It doesn't work. The stuff lasts seconds. So we're talking about a placebo. How about spending the time to rub your baby's gums, with? You know, pat them on the head with your fingers? I mean, Stop. come on. Wait, your a, wait a second. Look, I've got to be honest uh, here. Whiskey. Uh, no. well, How yes. about a binky? How about a binky? Have you ever worn a binky? No, excuse me. Look, right when, now. <laughs> when my kids were young, and I, I know this uh, 30, 40 years ago, uh, on occasion, we would dip one of those, what were they called? Um, yeah, the dominoes? Pacifiers. No, no, no. Uh, a Q-tip. You dip a Q-tip Q -tip into some alcohol, and then apply yeah. it to where the tooth is hurting the child. Like now, some whiskey, am, I, right? am I a terrible parent uh, for admitting that 30, 40 years ago? But you know what, Doc? It works. And your children have turned out great. Absolutely. They have. Absolutely. I'm all for that. This is ridiculous. And this is one of those things where something keeps getting marketed. What? Because people are buying it, and it doesn't have a m medical integrity. And I'm all for this. And the FDA is, is on this. And they're going to have to comply. One company, uh, Church and Dwight Company, has already removed several products from the market. Manufacturers have said they're going to comply. This is the FDA at its best. They can force them to comply, by the way. I find it fascinating. Origel, gone. Thanks very yeah, much indeed, wow. Doctor. The, a fascinating story. Of a, 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 Everybody's yeah, talking yeah, about this exactly. this morning. Yeah. Children Thanks, are safer Doc. now for this. Babies are safer. Okay, we got okay. it.